Hi everyone, welcome back to Earn and Grow PH my name is Mike. In today's video we'll talk about the history of cryptocurrency and how it works. And don't forget to hit subscribe, like button, and bell notification. Cryptocurrencies are digital currencies that use cryptography, a technique for encoding data to make it unreadable to anyone who lacks a password. Because of cryptography, cryptocurrencies are practically impossible to forge, though their security is also dependent on several other factors. Modern cryptocurrencies are decentralized systems based on blockchain technology. The blockchain is a distributed database structure first described by a cryptographer named David Chom in his 1982 doctoral dissertation. In the crypto X world, the blockchain serves as a public ledger of encrypted transactions that is maintained and updated by thousands of people all over the world. Transactions are anonymous but are publicly available. The first decentralized cryptocurrency was Bitcoin, which was first released as open source software in 2009. As of March 2022, there were more than 9,000 other cryptocurrencies in the marketplace, of which more than 70 had a market capitalization exceeding $1 billion. Cryptocurrencies are a type of digital currency decentralized and not controlled by any government. The history of cryptocurrencies can be traced back to the 1980s, when they were called cyber currencies. These coins started gaining in popularity in 2008 with the introduction of Bitcoin, which was created by an anonymous programmer or group of programmers under the name Satoshi Nakamoto. Satoshi Nakamoto is the name used by the presumed pseudonymous person or persons who developed Bitcoin, authored the Bitcoin white paper, and created and deployed Bitcoin's original reference implementation. As part of the implementation, Nakamoto also devised the first blockchain database. Since the launch of Bitcoin in 2009, cryptocurrencies have been all the rage. Over the past few years, their popularity has only grown, with more and more people investing in them. But what are they, and where did they come from? P idea of cryptocurrencies 1980s The cryptocurrency was first mentioned in 1989, and a few years after in 1980, American cryptographer David Chom invented digital cash, which relied on cryptography to secure and verify transactions. But it was only in the early 1990s that cryptographic protocols and software began to be developed that would make possible the creation of a truly decentralized digital currency. In October 2008, a paper by Satoshi Nakamoto, a pseudonym titled Bitcoin, a peer-to-peer -peer electronic cash system outlined a system for creating a digital currency that did not require trust in any third party. Nakamoto's paper effectively launched the cryptocurrency revolution. The launch of Bitcoin 2009 Bitcoin is a cryptocurrency and worldwide payment system. Satoshi Nakamoto created the Bitcoin protocol in 2009, the same year it launched as open source software. Bitcoin has become increasingly popular with people who need to send money across borders without interference from banks or governments. Still, its rapid rise in value has made it difficult for some people to know what they should do worry their Bitcoins. The first Bitcoin transaction took place between Nakamoto and Hal Finney on 12 January 2009. It wasn't until February of the following year that someone realized how valuable this new technology could be when one person paid 10,000 bitcoins for two pizzas delivered by Papa John's. That transaction would now be worth millions of dollars. The initial crypto market development in early 2010, bitcoin was the only cryptocurrency in the market. At that time, its price was just a few cents. Over the next few years, new digital currencies entered the market, and their prices rose and fell along with bitcoins. Throughout this period of volatility, many people lost faith in cryptos as an investment vehicle. However, beginning in late 2017, cryptos began to see unprecedented growth. The total market cap for all cryptocurrencies reached $820 billion in January 2018 before crashing later that month. Despite this crash, the crypto market has seen steady growth throughout. The era of crypto scams 2017 was the year of cryptocurrency. As the value of Bitcoin and other digital coins skyrocketed, so did the number of schemes and scams targeting crypto investors. From fake initial coin offerings ICOs, to phishing attacks, thieves managed to steal millions of dollars from innocent people looking to make a quick buck in the crypto craze. With regulators aiming for the cryptocurrency world, 2022 will likely see even more scams surface. Bitcoin's rise to popularity Bitcoin has been the subject of many discussions and debates, but it isn't easy to pinpoint when Bitcoin first became popularized. Many believe that Bitcoin's rise was in 2017, increasing from $1,000 to $20,000 before crashing back down below $10,000.
Others argue that Bitcoin's popularity skyrocketed due to cryptocurrency exchanges like Coinbase, making it easier for people with limited technical knowledge or experience to trade cryptocurrencies. Thank you so much guys for watching this video. I hope to see you next time.